Hello everyone, welcome to Daily Dose of Astrology for Thursday 21st of September. I'm Rod Zhang. Um, for next two days, Moon will be in Sagittarius and on Friday, it will move to Capricorn. Uh, for European time, it will be in the evening and for the America, it will be in the afternoon. Usually, this will cre will create will create a very different feeling on Friday, especially in the Friday evening. On the Thursday and the Friday morning, we will feel joy and active. And this is the moon in Sagittarius, and especially we have two set of kite in the sky. So you know, um, it is very happy feeling. Usually, we can feel that kind of happy go lucky, but. This doesn't mean everything will going well because in the sky at this moment we have two set of uh, aspects uh, suggest the conflict. One is Mars opposite Chiron. Another set of aspect is Sun opposite the um, Neptune. Sun opposite Neptune can usually cause some confuse and uh, also we may lose the direction or maybe we feel like uh, being being uh, deceived. Then that is not a pleasant feeling, but it's a part of a kite, so we can deal with it. Another set of aspect I say is a Mars opposite Chiron. This usually cause some casualty and and also confrontation, anger issue, conflict, or maybe sometime it would be have kind of a large scale injury. So be careful and keep an eyes on your safety and your environment okay but with the moon moving into the sagittarius in the fire sign together form a, a fire grand tri with venus and the chiron this is a very comfortable situation and it helps us to express our feeling, to help us to, to tell people how do we feel and what we want. Uh, Venus and uh, is kind of a comfortable planet. And in the fire side, maybe we can kind of indulge ourselves, but uh, well, uh, it can also kind of overindulge or overcompensate. But I would say, why not? If you are happy, don't worry about it, okay? These two set of a kite can really help us deal with a lot of a problem uh, when we face the challenge or when we face the problem. Just go for it because one set of kite formed by Sun, Pluto, Uranus, and uh, Neptune, this is kind of a weekend very clearly to see the environment change and how we're going to deal with problem. The another set of kites with the moon, Venus and Chiron are usually help us to aware about our uh, injury or our wounded part of our childhood, of our relationship, of love life, of friendship. But together with Mars in the um, Libra, we are able to speak out we can tell people, say, I'm not happy with this. I don't feel comfortable with it. Could we deal this with another way? This Mars, Mars in Libra is usually very civil and good for communication. So use this to help us to deal with problem. But I have to say that uh, Mars opposite Chiron are not really easy to deal with. Somehow it can trigger us, especially the things related to masculinity or our, um, our willpower, how we express ourselves. Also, it's about maybe some relationship with male or with uh, some people who are very aggressive and uh, or very active. So this set pop this set of uh, aspect uh, sometimes we need to deal deal with it very carefully, but Moon, Venus with Chiron with Mars, it is also can help us to heal our wounds in the past, in the childhood related to love, related to friendship. Well, this is today's uh, daily dose astrology. If you like, please subscribe and share or leave a comment. This is AOA UK on TikTok and AOA UK ROD on Instagram. I'm Rod Chang. See you tomorrow.